Give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Harakakwadash. Those are the names of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, who the world ignorantly calls God, in the name of His Son, Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly called Jesus Christ, in the name of the Holy Spirit. I would also like to give a double honors unto my apostles and elders of great millstone that do rule well, that have taught me this truth. And I would also like to say a sincere shalom unto the hopeful elect that are scattered throughout the four winds of the earth unto the true and sincere brothers that are out there prophesying and laboring in this truth and in this doctrine. Unto you I say shalom. Deluded truths and false visions. And that's what a lot of these false prophets, all right, that are coming up, you know, all right, that have been around, that are coming up, in these last days are bringing forth, all right, deluded truths, meaning they're telling you some truths, but they're not giving you the whole truth, all right? They have false visions where they 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 have the world believe that the Lord is dealing with them, okay, that they saw this, that they saw this, and but the Lord ain't dealing with them, okay? And you can know, and you and you're going to know these false prophets really by their doctrine and by their actions and how they move. All right, and the closer we get to the end of this, the Lord is revealing to Esau, of course, the wicked, the devil, his wicked agenda, but the Lord is also revealing those false prophets out there that he haven't sent, all right, that are bringing forth deluded truth, that have respect of person. In this truth, you can't have respect of person, whether it's women, children, okay, a, a, you know, whatever, all right? You can't, you know, you can't uh, um, dilute your doctrine all right. Yeah, you push Israel, but you don't push this or you don't or, or teach this or teach, you know, you can't. Hey, you got to give the people you got to give the the, the 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 people the word straight. All right. You know, nothing in between. All right. The, um, I heard Apostle um, Gabar say in a lesson one time, there's no Hebrew word for maybe or kind of. All right. Is that your nays be nay and your yays be yay. All right. And you have a, these prophets out, these false prophets out here have um you know that they're mixing this truth with things of this world okay they, they're, they're putting forth gimmicks out there to bring people in and that's the word is the word is all we need all right the word is pure all right which what more pure can you get or what more do you want you, we're giving you the word we're giving you the, the 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 truth all right we're breaking down the scriptures in their proper context for you israelites you so-called negroes latinos and native americans we're breaking down the strongholds, but as we break them down, you got IUIC, all right, of course, ISUPK, these other false Israelite groups out there, these startup groups that's putting um, different strongholds up, okay? So let me start with, um, you know, actually, um, I can't post the scriptures on my phone because uh, Satan is messing with my internet right now. So I'm going to read the scriptures from my phone and, um, you know, just go from there. Well, our first scripture I want to grab is Isaiah 1, and uh, I'll start at 21. This is really talking about the nation of Israel, but it can also apply it to a lot of these false prophets out here. The point is really in 22, uh, where it says the wine has been mixed with water, because when you mix wine with water, all right, it, it, it dilutes it, all right? It's not, as, and it's not in its purest form. Like anything, like a like a drink. Like of course, I'm talking about wine, but it, like if you buy a go to a bar, you can tell if the drink is watered down. All right, that's what these guys, all right, these false prophets out here, all right, are doing to the truth. Okay, they're 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 not they're not giving you the uh, um, they're not breaking down the prophecies in its fullness. They're not even prophesying. Yeah, they're telling that you're Israelites and they're telling you to keep the law, and that's it. Are they correlating? um current events with, with with the scriptures not really all right because a lot of these a lot of these jake's um uh doctrine and, and the things that they do is just full of folly full of you know things of this world cookouts and uh, uh uh you know come to the to the um you know to the school and meet a wife and all these you know uh, uh different type of celebrations they, the truth ain't about all that shit okay but they're diluting the truth with their with their false visions, with their false uh, uh, teachings, all right, with the, with their own vain opinions and what they think, it ain't about what we think. It ain't our truth, okay. So let me start with I said Isaiah one and twenty one. Uh, twenty one. How has a faithful city become a harlot? It was full of judgment, righteousness lodged in it, but now murderers. All right, we're talking about the nation of Israel as a whole. Thy silver is dross. 
by mixed that wine mixed with water. All right, and and that's these you know um, like I said, wine was pure, but they've mixed it with water. Silver is uh, uh, supposed to shine, but it, it it's become dross. All right, and, and that's speaking of the nation of Israel because we went off, went off as a nation. All right, by first and foremost following after false deities and gods. All right, and and, and um you know pretty much turning our back on uh, on the heavenly Father, but it's a remnant that will return. It's a remnant that will come back uh, uh, and repent. All right, and and um and sincerely repent. All right, when I ain't talking about you know you know that that sh that you know how Jake do it in the, in the world with the Christianity. You go up to the church on Sunday and you get saved and you are holier than now. Now and then on, on on Tuesday, Wednesday, you back doing the same shit. All right, just same thing with these these false Israelite groups. All right, they they you know they they have the appearance of men of the Lord. Okay, they they talk well. They 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 know some scriptures. They know some breakdowns, but inwardly these guys is proud as hell. All right, they they've been you know they've been put on some type of pedestal by their congregation because they're puffed up with wisdom and, and knowledge, and all these people that follow them think that they're just great men of the Lord and because of their, their outward appearance and how they talk down on other groups. And, but these guys is, these guys is really, <laughs> these guys is really, you know, uh, they don't got the spirit. All right. They, 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 they're really small inside. All right. Like, but they, but like I said, on the outward appearance, it, 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 they make the world seem like, you know, they're just great men of the Lord. All right. Um, but this is all a part of the both sides plan, okay? In the last days, there's going to be more false prophets than there are real prophets, real, true and sincere prophets, all right, that are in this for the love of Yahweh Bashim Shai because, you know, they want to they, they want to uh, uh, make their self, they, they're making themselves and they, they to a living sacrifice by going out and, 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 you know, pushing this word, okay? Waking up the elect, all right? You know, um, you know, not making it about them. All right, a lot of these groups make it about them. All right, make it about them and their congregation. Like I said, they, they think that they they make it seem like it's their truth. All right, I want to grab another scripture real quick in um, Second uh, Corinthians four and um, I think it's seven, six, six. Damn, where's the scripture? Bear me one second. I wish I could put it up on the damn thing. Uh, here it is. Um, uh, 2 Corinthians 4 and 7. But we have this tr have this treasure in earthen vessels that the excellency of the power may be of the Most High and not of us. This is a this is a, a, a treasure that we have, this truth, this knowledge. Okay? We and and, and we're supposed to treat it as a treasure, all right? A, a treasure, you're not just going to, you know, uh, uh, um, you're going to guard it, all right? You're going to protect it, all right? You, you're, you're not going to just, you know, give it to anyone, all right? You're going to, uh, you know, take care of it, all right? Like this truth, all right? You, this truth ain't for everybody, okay? Everyone's going to hear it, but it ain't for everybody. But these groups out here are making it seem like, oh, we're going to save all Israel, all right? We're going to start a, a, a save the black community. All right, we're going to have fundraisers. We're going to have cookouts. They're going to have all this bullshit when they could be they're using all this energy for all this worldly bullshit where they could be out there teaching it, te teaching the truth. All right. Uh, uh, um, you know, like uh, I think Apostle Tahar went into it. And they got all these men. OK, but you should be you should be setting up with all these men until you got a thousand men. You, you, that's at least a, 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 a hundred camps or more. OK, but. They got they got the numbers, but they don't got the the knowledge. All right, because all these men that IUIC got, and how many of them are teachers? How many of them can break down the, what the MOTB is? All right, and be right about it. All right, because they have their breakdown, but we know it's off. Because a lot of these guys have been compromised. A lot of these guys out here are not. They they have they come into the truth. They may be sincere at first, but eventually they have ulterior motives. All right, they, they they you know they want to they want to be rich. They want to have fame. They want to have a a rap career. They want to have all this shit that don't pertain to salvation. All right, um, 
like I said, this truth is pure. All right, this truth don't need any special effects. Let me uh, grab this real quick. James, um, the book of James, chapter 3, and verse 17. But the wisdom that is from above is first pure. All right, this wisdom is from above. All right, it's pure. It, it don't need any, you know, uh, special effects. Then peaceable, gentle, and easy to be entreated, full of mercy and good fruits without partiality and without hypocrisy. All right. The truth don't the truth is not about none of that stuff. The truth is pure. All right. Um, let me see. Um I want to grab this in uh Jeremiah, back in the book of Jeremiah, chapter uh 14. And I'm going to start at verse, um, yeah, I'll start at, uh, verse, uh, 13. Then said, I, ah, Lord power, behold, the prophets say unto them, ye shall not see the sword, neither shall ye have famine, but I have given you a short peace in this place. Then the Lord said unto me, the prophets prophesy lies in my name. I sent them not, neither have I commanded them, neither spake unto them. They prophesy unto you a false vision and divination and a thing of not and the deceit of their hearts. These guys are speaking out. They're not giving the people the proper warning. You got all these ears, but you're not telling them about martial law. You're not telling them about the MOTB. All right. Famine. All right. Uh, 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 um, if if you're not going into the MOTB, you damn sure not telling them about uh, um, how things are um, are going digital, how um, this this dollar's about to crash. You're giving these you're giving your congregations smooth words, all right? Things that you know uh, uh, appease their emotions and you know you know uh, um, get them in a, a a comfortable place when you should be preparing the, preparing the people to be uncomfortable, okay? Preparing them for martial law, not physically but spiritually, because that's you know. And, and the main thing we need to get out of this is the name. And these guys don't even teach that. Okay? So, so I'm speaking specifically right now about IUIC, but there's a lot of other groups out there that don't push the name Yahweh and Yahweh Shai. Okay? That say Christ. All right? That, 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 and, and that's going there. That's, 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 um, that's going off because you, you're calling on a false, a false God. Christ is not the, not the name of the Heavenly Father's Son. All right, Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. All right, that, that that's the that's part of the new song. Okay, the names. All right, um, verse fifteen. Therefore, thus saith the Lord concerning the prophets that prophesy in my name, and I have not sent them. Yet they say, sword and famine shall not be in this land. By sword and famine, those by sword and famine shall those prophets be consumed. All right, so all those prophets, those these these so-called prophets out here, all right, that that consider themselves prophets, giving a, a a false warning to the people. Okay, you're gonna you're gonna be consumed by um, these plagues, by these judgments. Okay, and, and, and along with your congregation, but you leaders of these churches, the, you proud ass Jakes, you're gonna get it even worse. Okay, and, and the Lord is just letting, just like. You know, the Lord is letting that tab of Esau build up. A lot of these false prophets out here, the Lord is letting that tab build up too. Lest you repent, all right? And it ain't too late to repent, all right? It, it, the Lord is merciful. he give you time to repent, okay? But, hey, that 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 window of mercy is closing, and, and it's closing fast. All right, I'm going to jump over to um, Jeremiah 23 and um, verse 25. I have heard... What the prophet said that prophesied lies in my name, saying, I have dreamed a dream. How long shall this be in the heart of prophets that prophesy lies? Yea, they are prophets of the deceit of their own heart. They're speaking from their own heart, their own vain opinions. Okay? They a lot of times they just wing it. Okay? And when they do go off, they'll come back and, and then if they get it right, they won't, they <laughs> they will never say where they got it from, who they learned from. Okay, because eventually, but these guys is I don't know. I mean, these guys is they, these guys took the bag, man. Because they they're saying so much off shit now that you know it, it's like you you can't you can't you know it, it's no way. All right, these guys, you know, 
you know, we go back and forth, but they they know the scriptures, okay? And and and, and their leaders, all right, they should know better, okay? But hey, that money, that bag is pretty heavy, okay? These guys is in too deep to, to, to turn back, to tell their congregation to yo and have humility and say, hey, you know, we, we went off on this, this, and this. This is what it is, you know? Hey, it's, it's, the time is coming, okay? Where, where the internet be shut down, these you, you got martial law in these streets. Ain't nobody can leave their house. It's gonna come, and, and the, with the internet being shut down, phone service shut down, you ain't you ain't gonna send out a mass text message to your congregation and say, "Hey, the MOTB is the uh, the chip, okay? Uh, uh, the names of the Lord uh, uh, and His Son are Yahweh and Yahweh Shai. Calling upon those names, it ain't gonna happen like that, okay? So you better you guys better repent now. But the Lord, like 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 I um. Like the scripture says, the deceived and the deceiver are his, okay? The Lord is deceiving these prophets. The Lord is leading these prophets down a path of destruction because it's his will, okay? And those that he wants, he's going to take out of there. He's going to take out of these different congregations. He's going to take out of and pull them out of the fire, okay? Um, let me see. I got another scripture I want to grab. Micah, um... Chapter uh, 3, and I want to start at verse 9. Hear this, I pray you, ye heads of the house of Jacob and princes of the house of Israel that abhor judgment and pervert all iniquity. So this happened in the ancient world, okay, where you had um, false prophets, you had uh, the Levites during that time, which were, you know, the wicked ones of them were, you know, would, 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 um, were bought and paid for pretty much. Where, you know, they, they, they turned a blind eye to certain shit that was going on or, or sins or wickedness and took bribes. They took, um, you know, uh, 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 turtle doves and goats and lambs for sacrifice when Jacob's about to go off. The same things happen today. All right. But but they taking big bribes. All right. They, they're, they're, they're trading. All right. They're they're um, they're um, um, what is the word? Um. You know, they're, they're turn, pretty much turning their back on the flock for 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 things of this world. All right. Um, verse 10, Micah 3 and 10. They build up Zion with blood and Jerusalem with iniquity. The heads thereof judge for reward and the priests thereof teach for hire and the prophets thereof divine for money. Yet will they yet will they lean upon the Lord Yahweh and say, is not the Lord among us? None evil can come upon us. And, and that's essentially what they're saying. And in these days, well, the Lord is dealing with us. Look, look, look how, look what, look all the, 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 uh, the people we've brought in. Look at all the numbers we have. Look at these, uh, glorious, uh, uh, feasts and Passovers that we have. Okay. Look, look how the Lord is dealing with us. Look how they, and, and the people, the, um, the simple minded people of Israel. All right. They see that and they think they just like niggas in the church think that, the preacher got a, a a nice car, a nice house. He got a yacht, whatever. Um, they think that the Lord is dealing with this man. They thinking that you know just because they think gain is godliness, and that's not, that's that's not the truth. Okay, the, the, if Yahweh Shai came on the scene, they would call him a poor man. All right, he he even said that the, the the son of man have no place to rest his head. All right, but this was prophesied. All right. That in the last days they were going to come scoffers, they were going to come false prophets. All right, um, Second Peter uh, three and one, the second epistle, beloved, I now write unto you in both which I stir up your pure minds by the way of remembrance, that ye may be mindful of the words which I which which were spoken before the holy prophets, and of the commandments of us the apostles of the Lord and Savior. Let's talk about Yahweh Shai. Knowing this first, that there shall come in the last days scoffers walking after their own lusts and saying, where is the promise of his coming since the fathers fell asleep? Is this the one I want? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, let me see. No, 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 no. Is this not it? It's not it. Let me see. Is it, um... Hold on, I think it's another scripture I want to get. Uh, Timothy. Yeah, here it is. 2 Timothy 3 and 1. This know also that in the last days perilous times shall come. 
All right. And, and we're living in perilous times. All right. Are, are these other groups out there giving you a warning, a constant warning? All right. Putting up videos daily, going out daily. OK, going out in, in whatever, what, you know, whatever the weather is in whatever particular city. All right. It, it ain't, you know, a lot of these guys, they don't, they don't go out if it's too hot or it's too cold. All right. They go in between summer and uh, uh, um, in winter. All right. Fall. They pretty much spring and fall Israelites. OK, they don't go. They're not really making themselves a living sacrifice. All right. But the people blindly follow them because they think that they're these are men of the Lord. OK, um, for men shall be lovers of their own selves, covetousness, boasters, proud, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, unthankful, unholy, without natural affection, truth breakers, false accusers, incontinent, fierce despisers of those that are good. All right. Traitors, heady, high-minded, lovers of pleasure more than lovers of the most high. These guys love pleasure. They love to live a comfortable life. Okay? We, hey, we, you know, brothers is catching hell every day. Okay? We know that the, the hell that we catch, we know why we're catching it. Okay? We understand that. All right? That, that's a level of understanding you have when you're in this truth. The Lord is testing you every day. All right? The Lord is not going to place you in a, in a comfortable position where you can have money hand over fist and, you know, uh, uh, have the, uh, 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 you know, a great following. Hey, the, the, the scriptures say that, um, this, 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 uh, many are called, but few are chosen. Okay. It's another one that, um, damn, um, where the Lord is really not looking for, 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 for high numbers. All right. The elect is a, 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 a remnant. All right. The that's the word, a remnant. The Lord is looking for a um, a remnant. Let me see if this thing works. Uh, Isaiah 1. Oh, it's working now. Okay, Isaiah 1 and 9. Except the Lord of hosts have left unto us a very small remnant, we should have been as Sodom, and we should have been like unto Gomorrah. The Lord is only dealing with a small remnant. But these groups, they, they want to bring in as many followers as they can, you know? Because their, their, their hearts are really not set on edifying the elect. Their hearts are not really on uh, set on waking up the elect. Their hearts is set on their, 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 own, their own desires, their own lusts. All right. So the Lord warned us about these, about, about these men and to watch for them. Okay. And, and, and to warn the people. All right. We're supposed to give a warning. Just Not just, yeah, we give the people the warning for, for Esau coming down with great wrath, World War Three, the MOTB. The prophecies, but we got to warn the elect out there, the hopeful elect of these false prophets, all right, that 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 are pushing out false truths, half truths, okay, that are giving the people false visions and saying that, um, you know, even Nate said a while ago, um, it might have been some years ago that uh, it wasn't no Jacob's trouble, all right, he was on some Benjaminite Benjaminite show, and he he, he kind of dismissed Jacob's trouble. Jacob's trouble was clearly in the scriptures where it says it shall be a time of trouble. Like there never was since there was a nation, okay? But a lot of these guys, they don't want to go into these scriptures that deal with the in the, the real end times. Jacob's trouble, uh, um, you know, famine, great death. Because what are they? What will that do? That will scare a lot of followers away. All right, that 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 that'll you know you, you can't if you lose followers, you lose money. All right, so just be wary, be be circumspect of a lot of these false teachers out here that talk well. That speak with you know these million dollar words and and but at the end of the day they 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 they're uh they're pretty much dead inside okay because the lord they don't got the spirit they 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 they, they don't have the spirit of 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 uh of the habashi shai really all right so lord within this lesson was edifying unto the elect and i want to give all praise glory and honor unto yahweh bashim yahweh shai bahashim habakakodash shalom